Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. This is part two of what we started on Sunday. We are moving. We have some movers coming tomorrow. We're going to be moving over a couple of days, but I'm actually in my closet right now getting ready to take all of my clothes down. We already packed up a bunch of stuff, so it's kind of like a vlog style, get things done slash clean with me because I don't have an exact plan for what's going to happen today or exactly um, how much the baby's going to let me do, but let's get started. So I took down all my robes that were right there. <laughs> Not the neatest packing, but I also have like my leggings and all the stuff that was in my drawers. I left one outfit for tomorrow and some PJs for tonight. And then I'm going to try um, to put the stuff in garbage bags like all of you told me to do. Let's see how that turns out. Alright, so my closet is packed up. Now, for this. This is really unorganized right now, but it doesn't matter, it's all going in a box. Wide awake is the way that you left me. Sat beside in your car in the backseat. Wide awake is the way that you left me. Oh. Now it's clear we are here back in your house.
Hey, if you're wondering what my kids are doing, I mentioned this on our family channel, but Ella has been obsessed with watching her first unicorn birthday. She watches it at least once a day. This is twice today. So I am leaving this here for them as well as this because they just fit so perfectly and we won't be needing it in our new place. So we're gonna um, do the floors in here too. All right, the floors are clean in here, well like swept up. All this stuff is cleaned up. I'm going to finish up the bedroom um, and then I'll do like all the floors at once. Poor Barbie. Knew from the first time I saw ya. You are not like the others A cool kind of melody You rattled my cage without warning Kept it up right till the morning A new kind of ecstasy You found a different side of me The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah Like someone pretty need a different side of me, yeah. Down till we take flight It's how you make me feel Yeah, yeah Let's call in sick and be lazy I'm all for doing what's crazy Cause you make it real, yeah You found a different side of me The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah It's about 5 p.m. We're gonna go to Chipotle because we have no food in the fridge. I don't even know everything that I'm holding to go downstairs right now. Um, and it's one of those things, and if you're, you've ever moved before, I'm sure you can relate, especially with kids. It's my first time moving with kids. Um, you feel like you're getting nowhere, <laughs> and that's kind of how I feel right now. I know that tonight we need to finish up the office and the playroom, so we're definitely gonna do that, but right now, um, we need Chipotle. And just before we head out to Chipotle, this is what the kids did in the playroom while I was um, packing and cleaning and all that. So yeah, this should be uh, fun to pack up tonight. All right, you guys, it's 8.22. I know I look crazy. I think I have like coffee that I spilled on myself earlier and like just spit up and breast milk and all of that, but it's all good. Um, we're getting it done. I'm annoyed that they messed up the playroom, but I just don't feel like fighting with them to clean it up. Um, I know it's like probably really hard on them. They're excited to move, obviously, but it's a big change, so I'm trying to just be like more gentle 
with them. I know it's a lot. Um, I've been there as a kid. So now I guess I'm just gonna clean all of this up. What's really hard about all of this is that we do have movers tomorrow, but we also have them the following day. So like, I wanna leave some stuff for them to entertain themselves with. Um, but let's just see. I have no idea what I'm doing, but we'll figure it out together. treasure Okay, you guys, as you can see, I got a ton done in here. I'm starting to feel emotional now, though, for sure. Um, so before I have a mental breakdown, I'm gonna go ahead and do the kids' bathroom. Just close your eyes and know Beauty lives in me I know I don't yet know it So I trust you Guys, I'm gonna go cry my eyes out now. I think that was like the last draw for me. It was taking down for a little. 
their little um, towel holders, their names on it. And so now they're gonna have like separate bathrooms and just like, I don't know, I know, don't. We're so blessed and I'm just going to miss this house. <laughs> I know it's hard to understand because we're moving into like a bigger, more beautiful home, but we've had so many amazing memories here and I'm just so thankful for everything that this house has given us. And if I have any advice to anybody out there that is, you know, hoping to like upgrade things in their life is just be grateful in every single step of the way. Um, I feel like Chris and I, we were so grateful in our one bedroom apartment. We were grateful in our condo and then to this home. Um, and I just, I don't know, I'm just babbling, babbling now because I'm tired and emotional, but I can't believe this is my last video in this house. God, I'm sorry. Um, I, I wish that like we could have rented it out or something, but I know the new owners are going to love this home as much as we did, and yeah, I gotta go now because I'm hot mess. So thank you all so much for watching. Thanks for being here on this journey, and um, if you are not subscribed to our family channel, Make sure you go ahead and check out our family channel, Beats and Family Vibes. Um, we have a lot more like home videos on there and we wanna basically do like a tribute to this house. So I'm hoping that video will be up on that channel soon and like an empty house tour or something. But anyway, I have to go before I scare you guys. I'm like a hot mess over here. I definitely earned my shower. And thank you guys for always being here every step of the way. And I'm excited for you to come on this new journey with us and make that house a home with us as well. I will be the light.